Um, I'm gonna sit down for this thing. So I've not vlogged for quite a bit, so I just thought I'll do something. I need a haircut massively. That's ridiculous. Look at that. Look at that. I've been really wanting to get back to the theatre. I've not seen that many shows this year. But yeah, I'm off to the theatre tonight to watch When Darkness Falls. No idea what it's about. It looks pretty interesting. Um, it's a, All I know, it's a ghost story. So yeah, apologies for the lack of content. Uh, well, this year, really. I don't think I've done any. Um, am I in focus? I am now. I'm gonna give my review of the show. Um, I'll also give a review of my food, which is what I'm going to go and do now. I have no idea where I'm going to go. Uh, somewhere that's quick and easy, but luckily it's in the Grand Theatre, so something near around the theatre will be decent. Uh, but yeah, it's going to be a nice evening out and I hope you enjoy it. A few moments later. So, I'm in the cookhouse and pub, just underneath the um, Premier Inn, opposite the North Pier. And I've just ordered myself a steak rump and, well, chips, onion rings, roasted tomato and peas. And a, a glass of Coke. Just there. So, I'm gonna munch on this and then get to the theatre. That was nice. So after that meal, I'm now gonna head to the theatre and uh, enjoy an evening. I don't really know much about this show. I'm just gonna cross before I get run over. <laughs> but, uh, ooh, that's a nice angle. I like that. That's a good sunset. Later. Wow, okay, um, so that was incredible. Uh, so, just basically briefly, it's a one-act play. Um, it started from 7.30, it is now... It literally ended at like 20 past... 20 past 9. The script, wow, it's a lot. <laughs> the script is quite long and lengthy. Um, but no, honestly, when darkness falls, so intense, very intense. There was quite a few moments where um, the theatre audience were a bit annoying. Um, basically, theatre etiquette has gone downhill massively, and it's really upsetting to see. I was up in the uh, upper circle, and uh, I was actually thinking of moving if there was a second act and uh, there actually wasn't, which is good because I didn't want to move, I had a really good seat and uh, it was just unfortunate that people um, near me were spoiling it and in the whole audience itself, although <laughs> I did get a bit of a fright from uh, the person next to me because it was a very intense moment and uh, basically their phone just went off and <laughs> I absolutely jumped out of my skin, like it was literally gripping the edge of your seat stuff, but no absolutely amazing it really was if you can see it um, it is on tour um, Peter Duncan who's from Blue Peter uh, an ex Blue Peter presenter absolutely phenomenal acting both of them were phenomenal actors I'll put both of their names in down below it's literally just started to rain literally as I just started to get the camera out um, again the actual show itself the thing that I enjoyed the most probably was the set, which you saw a picture from before, but I'll probably put another one in again. Uh, that was awesome. Loved the set. Um, the um, there was hardly any sound. It was just like sound effects, um, the special effects, making it look like there was ghosts in the room. Um, absolutely incredible. The lighting was phenomenal. Uh, there was hardly any other colour apart from like orangey red and white, and they changed throughout all the stories just to add that effect. And oh, I, I love ghost stories. My favourite favourite play is The Woman in Black because again, a two-person actor show, led show, 
and um, yeah I mean this it was just incredible it really was and it's just unfortunate that the people around me did spoil it a bit but there's nothing you can do about that oh, it's literally just started to rain now <laughs> um, I'm gonna leave this here now so um, <laughs> I need to go and get home now and find uh, probably the tram or the bus um, but if you enjoyed this video please give it a like um, comment if you wish um, subscribe and do make sure you click that bell button so that you are notified every time I release a new video um, apart from that there's nothing else for me to say apart from I need to get home as soon as possible I'm in work tomorrow but um, yeah I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it wasn't too long and uh, yeah Look at how gorgeous the tower looks. Oh, the hair looks awful. <laughs> right, see you later. Have a, have a nice uh, day or whatever you're doing whenever you're watching this video. Uh, but yeah, bye. I've been flying from town to town, from London to Taiwan. I've been all around the globe trying to protect your soul.